It's been five years already since the atomic explosion struck and caused the death of many people and several degrees of injuries to persons living in and around Atomic Junction in Accra. Following the tragedy, government in a bid to sanitize the industry placed a ban on the establishment of new LPG outlets for assessment to be conducted by the relevant authority. The ban means owners who had begun or were yet to construct new LPG retail outlets had their properties and investments grounded to a standstill. Against this backdrop, stakeholders in the LPG business have been calling for government to lift the ban but their request has yielded no result. The Gas Tanker Drivers Association is one of such stakeholders who say they have been bearing the brunt of government's directive to ban new LPG retail outlets from operating. They say now you are paying loan, so you can't pay, can pay a large hill of money. At least, if you know work, you work. If you know pay, you like three thousand. You supposed to receive it. Uh, some people too, they don't pay them through bank. They don't have any snit. They take table top. So unless you, you yourself, you know, if you don't pay, you work without pay. Unless you do one of two things, you want stop those things. You see, if you pay, you you can know how to manage. Me and me know, cause my boss of four stations. Me in our room. So see, I see on pay a key. Stations here. We are called loan. Gas bog, bog. And you grow permit as I see cement. Oh, the other states is winning. I can grow into no BM penny for cannon. It's no magic. You were driving here and Opuka in Tianaka. A big trail away, a man of 500 cities a month. Say trail away, bomb be at me. Me, I'm a look as a Mississippi woman's own. A rare abdomen, I'm a digna. That's a Ubika car when we 500 cities a man and manta. Say it. It's in the extra mine. Stations. It is a woman permit no or yen a duma. If you say driving in a baton, it is a bit more increasing the pay. Owners of various LPG retail outlets are also paying the price of the continuous ban on the operationalization of their facilities. Members of the Gas Tanker Drivers Association, whose work is to transport LPG to the various outlets across the country, have resolved to embark on the sit down strike beginning Friday, March 4, 2022, until their concerns are fully addressed. An immediate lifting of the ban on construction of LPG stations by our various LPG owners, which they have invested so much money into that, those stations and the promise given to us by the authorities from five years ago that they will consider and reopen those stations for us. We are not putting all our tools down but for now the LPG drivers because authorities refuse to listen and lift the ban on the LPG stations that are lying ajar, we are putting our service down on LPG. In solidarity, the Ghana National Petroleum Tanker Drivers Association, who transports petrol and diesel, disclosed that they will join the industrial action if government refuses to address their concerns as soon as possible. Members of the association told City News on the sidelines that all efforts to get the regulator, the National Petroleum Authority and other authorities to lift the ban have proven futile. Meanwhile, the National Petroleum Authority has been responding to the concerns of the Gas Tanker Drivers Association. The decision for the suspension was not yet the decision of government. If you remember that time, it was, it, it was not the decision of MDA, but the decision of cabinet. So subsequently, we engaged government after listening to the LP uh, marketed association to try and meet them halfway on their demand because by one they said that a lot of their people have invested so much into the construction and because of the suspension they've had their investment locked up. So we were engaging government and cabinet for that matter to try and see how they would be able to grant at least for those who have already uh, are constructed and were about to realize so that they can get to net and remove their investment. Uh, government is actually in consideration of this particular engagement that it is. Uh, that as I speak to now, I don't have firm communication from government.
The Gas Tanker Drivers Association has on Friday, that is today, uh, begun a sit-down strike that will involve their members who will cut LPG products across the country. They have raised concerns about their remuneration and also the ban on the operationalization of some fuel stations um, by government following the 2017 atomic um, bombing or explosion that happened in the country. They're thus calling on government to address their concerns sense with immediate effect. Reporting for City News, my name is Kweku Ediyama Ansa.